On this day, 4th of December, Ramaswamy Venkataraman, the 8th President of India, was born in 1910 in a village in the present-day Tanjore district of Tamil Nadu. He secured a degree in economics from the Loyola College Madras and later studied law. He practiced law and got involved with the Indian National Congress and the Freedom Movement. He participated in the Quit India Movement in 1940s for which the government acted against him. After World War II ended, he was sent to some Southeast Asian nations along with other lawyers to defend Indians who had been accused of supporting the Japanese occupation. After India became independent, Venkataraman worked at the Madras Provincial Bar Federation as secretary. He was also a member of the Constituent Assembly, responsible for drafting India's constitution. He later became an MP and he was also the secretary of the Congress Parliamentary Party for a while. He was re-elected to the Lok Sabha in 1957 but resigned his seat and instead became a minister at the Madras state government and leader of the upper house in the state. His portfolios as minister included industries, labor, cooperation, power and transport. Between 1967 and 71, he was a member of the Union Planning Commission where he covered industry, power, transport, labor, communications and railways. He was elected to the Lok Sabha in 1977 from Madras and during this stint in the parliament, he was also the chairman of the Public Accounts Committee. He held several other posts in his long career, including the member of the Union Cabinet's Political and Economic Affairs Committees. He was a delegate to the General Assembly of the United Nations several times and between 1955 to 1979, he was the member of the United Nations Administrative Tribunal. After being re-elected to the Lok Sabha in 1980, Venkataraman became the Union Finance Minister in the Indira Gandhi Cabinet. He was later made the Defence Minister. In August 1984, he was elected as the Vice President of India. He resumed office of President on July 25, 1987. His term, which lasted till 25th of July 1992, was really a turbulent time for Indian politics as it marked the beginning of the coalition era. Venkataraman received several honours including the Tamra Patra for participation in the freedom movement. He died on January 27, 2009 at the age of 98 in Delhi after suffering from multiple organ failure.